That's it. We got it. So this wall is done. We're going to, I think we're going to put up some sheathing. On this wall? Yeah. First, before we do the other wall? Um, maybe. Okay. I think it might be easier to get in and out. That's true. Move around, yeah. <laughs> that is true. All right, so we've measured four feet up on, on, on each side of the trailer. And we've stretched the chalk line. We're gonna snap it. I hope there's enough chalk in here so we leave it a line. I think it's good enough. You can see it on most studs, yeah. Okay, we're good. You know, we get some more chalk in this. Perfect. All right, we're gonna come around this way. Uh, we're about to put up our first piece of sheathing and our studs are so long that I'm afraid there may be some bends and some bows in them and they may not be exactly 16 on center once we get to the middle. So I'm going to be measuring 16 on center on my plywood so I can actually just bend the studs to where I want them to be, I guess. All right. And we're just a quick, just a quick push. Yeah. Akira did a little double tap double there. Double tap. So just get it against there and just do one push and pull back. Good. Another one. And we know that we had put that jack in here, right? Yeah. So we can hit one. Here. And then here we have to be a little tricky because we want to catch a good amount of this, but we don't want it to shoot out the other side. So I'm going to try here. That looks good. Here. That's good. Actually, why don't I do it now before we go in? Oh. Now we have this side of the gun, the first roll of the seating, and the other side of the wall. We're going to take a break, and after that, we're going to start on that end. around day six on the build feeling a little extra corny um, so today we're gonna do a little bit more sheathing and um, and then get the rafters up so that way tonight we can cover this whole thing with a large tarp because it's getting a little bit wetter than I would like so that's the plan 